Claude from Anthropic is now available to users in 95 countries. That's a huge jump from its initial launch, which was only in the US and UK. But here's the real deal. Claude can handle a prompt length of up to 100,000 tokens. That's nearly 75,000 words. Imagine the depth of conversation you can have with that. This isn't another ChatGPT 4 versus Claude showdown video. There's plenty of that already out there. We are here to talk about how to use Claude effectively and why it is a solid AI choice. Anthropic, the company behind Claude, was founded in 2021 by a group of ex-OpenAI employees who helped develop OpenAI's GPT-2 and GPT-3 models. It's focused on AI research with a focus on safety above all. And they're doing it through something they call constitutional AI. You can visit this link to read more about it. Now let's get into prompting with Rupak. Claude and GPT prompts are similar, but Claude has a few tricks up its sleeve that can make your prompts even better. We've got three tips for you, and this is all thanks to Anthropic's openness with their research of prompting. Claude is tuned to recognize XML tags. This means you can break your prompt into sections, making it easier for Claude to understand. You can clearly tell Claude what your instructions are and what text that these instructions should be applied for. So rather than asking questions directly, use XML tags. For example, rather than asking which is the number one cricket team, I put in a question tag and asked it. Ignore the remaining part of the prompt. I will explain that as we go ahead. You don't have to overthink what to put in tags, as there are no special or reserved names for these tags. Don't worry about the tag names, it's the format that counts. Just make sure you've got your opening angle brackets and closing angle brackets. I'm sure you've been there, giving GPT the best prompt you've got and it still goes off doing its own thing. It makes you wonder, wouldn't it be great to see how GPT is interpreting what you're asking? Enter Claude. And it's got this neat trick with thinking tags. These tags let Claude jot down its thought process before it spits out an answer. This is especially handy for complex questions, like math problem. Let's run through an example. Instead of just asking, how many paper clips can I fit in a Maruti 800 car? You set it up like this. When you reply, first plan how you should answer within thinking XML tags. This is your space to map out your thoughts. Once you're done, present your final answer to the user within the answer XML tags. Remember, we are looking for detail and precision here. This way, Claude lays out its approach step by step. So if something's off in the answer, you can trace back to where Claude might have taken a wrong turn. This is the major pain point of AI, hallucination. While Claude is trained to be an honest assistant, it may still occasionally hallucinate, fabricating facts or details that aren't true or finding things in inputs that aren't actually there, all in an effort to be as helpful as possible. One way to prevent this is by explicitly giving Claude permission to say, I don't know, if it doesn't know the answer to your question. Let's use an example. I asked which cricket team is number one. Claude responded that India is number one in tests while Australia leads in T20 and ODIs. However, according to the ICC website as of November 2023, India is ranked number one in all formats. Now, let's see how Claude answers when given permission to say it doesn't know. Remember to use XML tags for structure and to prompt it to think. When allowed to say, I don't know, the answer I received was, I'm afraid I don't closely follow cricket rankings to know for certain which team is number one right now. You can also see the thinking pattern it followed and it was correct in that approach. But these are three unique ways of prompting to get the best results from Claude. You can achieve the same quality of results from ChatGPT4 too. But there is a difference between a system that can understand and a system that is designed to understand in a particular way. So keep these three things in mind in case you plan to use Claude for the long term.